Let's go. Relax. All right. Yeah. Okay, let's go. I think we can take it out. Right. Right. Gotcha.
over at least. Hey, did you all survive? Uh, we managed to survive today, too. It would be good to go home and freshen up. I can't wait to go home. I imagined it. This is Soma. So far, no contact with the target. We'll continue to investigate. Did you hear? They're assigning another new type. Oh? That's news to me. There's been a flood of new types lately, huh? I hear the director brought her over himself from the Russia branch. Hey, speak of the devil. I have an introduction to make. This is a new type recruit. She'll be joining your ranks today. Nice to meet you. My name is Alyssa Ilinichina Amiela. As of 1200 hours today, I've been transferred here from the Russia branch. I look forward to working with you. Hey, girls are more than welcome here anytime. I'm amazed that you've survived so long around here with that frivolous attitude. Huh? She doesn't have much experience in actual combat, but her scores in the simulated battle were quite stellar. You'd better train hard, or she'll soon surpass you. Yes, ma'am. Alyssa, I want you to serve under Lindo's supervision. Understood? Yes, ma'am. Lindo, I need to hand off some documents to you, so come with me. The rest of you can go back to your quarters. That's all. Hey, hey, so you're from Russia? Isn't it freezing over there? Oh, but I guess with all the global warming these days, the temperatures are getting higher. What a promising rookie. We've got to be the only branch with two of these rare new types. Yes, I suppose so. But we'll be stepping up the search for new type matches from now on. HQ's new policy. The thing is, this girl may be a match, but she's also somewhat mentally unstable. The doctors have her attending a medical health care program on a regular basis. At any rate, I want you to stay alert around her. Understood, Big Sis. Lindo, don't ever call me Big Sis here again. Got that? I can handle this alone. Please search for the enemy. We're searching. Okay, I'll go take a look. wander around.
the enemy. Gotcha.
shows up, just slash it to hell. <sighs> we managed to survive today, too. Good job, everyone. It would be good to go home and freshen up. I can't wait to go home. As I mentioned before, the oracle cells which comprise an origami will eat anything. Not just life forms like animals and plants, but also minerals and synthetic resins, such as plastics. It will even devour nuclear waste, known to be toxic to normal life forms. Buildings, solid earth, you name it. See, this is what happens. As a result, the environment as we know it, left over so to speak, is diminishing at a high rate. In this area, people were once known to view cherry blossoms in spring and maple leaves in autumn. But by now, there's no hope of ever doing that. Meanwhile, the origami tend to occasionally take on the qualities of the things they've eaten. Recently, some origami have been actually discovered photosynthesizing. 79% nitrogen, 21% oxygen. Despite the fact that we have only a third of the plants that existed in the world 20 years ago, somehow the air of this planet has been preserved. Don't you find it extremely ironic that we owe this phenomenon to the origami's photosynthesis? Uh, Mom, I can't eat anymore. Really? He has no sense of duty whatsoever. Listen, people. Have you ever heard the term Nova's Devouring Apocalypse? Yes. After the Aragami battle among themselves, the extinction of humankind is triggered by Nova, an entity grown so huge that it can swallow up the entire planet. Exactly. No one even knows who first spoke of this event. And some people have dismissed it as an idle rumor. But once the Aegis Project is completed, we'll be safe from even that. Do you know what kind of animal a dog is? Huh? Their numbers are quickly dwindling. But even now you can see some dogs existing around the outer ghetto. Dogs are intelligent. They may not be able to speak or understand specific words, but they can communicate with humans. If an origami takes on the qualities of a dog, then perhaps we can find a way to coexist. Coexist? Of course, from a communication standpoint, we're not limited to dogs. Long ago, you could watch an animal tamer manipulate wild beasts in a tent called a circus. But there's no way that we can ever get along with Aragami. <laughs>